we want to introduce you now to a woman who is truly amazing. Andrea Farrell had just given birth to her first baby in 2011 when she was blindsided by devastating news. She had breast cancer. What was supposed to be the happiest time of her life was now full of doubt. After she was diagnosed, Andrea had genetic testing. It was found she was positive for the BRCA1 genetic mutation, which increases a woman's chances of getting breast and ovarian cancer. It's the same mutation Angelina Jolie recently said she had. Andrea endured chemo, a double mastectomy, and reconstructive surgery, all while being a brand new mom. She said the hardest part about the surgeries, she was not able to lift and hold her son. And now, almost a year later after her surgery, her last surgery, she is cancer-free, and she's become an inspiration to breast cancer and pa patients and survivors all over the country. She launched a new company called Blush Life Apparel, a special line of bras for women just out of surgery. And Andrea Farrell is here right now with Susan for our must-see, must-share segment tonight. Yeah, I'm very excited to talk about this and meet Andrea as well. We were talking during the commercial break. You said you were floored when you were diagnosed because you were in shape, you felt good, you just had a baby. What did you think when you got the diagnosis? Well, it's almost like an out-of-body experience. This is something that happens to other people. It doesn't happen to you. So, of course, when I got the news, I was completely shocked because I had taken care of my body. I had taken care of my health and the way that I ate and my diet. So, definitely surprising to me. And your little boy's adorable, by the way. You, you can tell you're a go-getter because the first thing you figured out was, wait a minute, there's not a bra out there that feels comfortable that's conducive with this diagnosis. So, you went ahead and made your own. Talk about this. Absolutely. Well, in August of last year, I had underwent a double mastectomy, and through that process, I could not find a product that worked with me from start to finish. That's when I started working on this design. I first wanted to look at function and fabric because it has to be comfortable and it has to function throughout the entire process. You uh, immediately following the surgery have tubes that mm -hmm. come and protrude out of your and back. If you turn one of the mannequins around, you can tell there's an area on this where the tubes can go through. Absolutely. And the material's comfortable as well because that was a big issue. You have a young son and you're healing at the same time and this bra allows that to happen. It does. So it's got the tubes, that, uh, the holes that allow for the tubes. It also has the comfortable fabric. If you can imagine your most comfortable t-shirt, that's something that I was looking for. But I also wanted different fabric options that could work with the body and also um, wick moisture away from the body, uh, as well as a front closure. So that's another thing that we offer are different options of front closure. So you can have the clasp, you can have the zippers. Um, it will also work and function with you through the expansion process because as you're undergoing reconstructive surgery, your body is changing every other week. I think there's such a market for this, obviously, and it's amazing to me that you not only decided that people need this, other survivors can also get this now. And the Facebook page for the company, uh, people can share their stories. Your story, you had a young boy, three and a half months old when you were diagnosed. You found out, though, that you were cancer-free a day before his first birthday. How was that? I did. It was a huge celebration for, for everyone, for both of us. Um, but I am uh, seven months into remission, and I just want to help other people. I want to do my part. I want to give back. I figured if I felt this way going through the process, mm -hmm. other women had to feel the same. So this is a way that we can feel beautiful, we can feel comfortable, and take something where our femininity has been stripped from us and, and kind of get that back. Because when... You look good, you feel good. And I think you're helping them physically with the product, of course, and emotionally, because I think that's key for women to connect and talk about what they went through, how they're getting through in days they may not feel so strong. I'm going to tweet out uh, the product and your Facebook page as well. I think you're doing amazing things. So nice to meet you. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you.